We will just go to a bunch of other people that might like it and just, you know, play it down quite a bit and just say, oh, it's a lot of fun, you know, you're camping in the woods. And then on the river, you're fine, we got a guide. <laughs> My goal is to not fall out of you know, some of the people who've been on the trip in the past will be like, don't trust what she says. I was like, they're gonna make you go on the four person raft on the upper gully and they're gonna wanna dump it every chance they can, which is not true at all. Um, and then when they start the safety speech, um, it's kind of like a hushed silence. We've had a couple of people who are like, maybe I shouldn't do this. And we're like, shut up, you're doing it. You're not allowed to say no, no matter what they say. Yeah. Love you guys. <laughs> Probably eight years ago, I was working up in Michigan with a bunch of CRNAs and I came down on a trip with like 14 of us. And it was my first time rafting a lot of our first times. and. We had such a good time doing it that um, next year when I moved, I didn't really know anybody. And um, I just started trying to recruit people because it was such a good time, you know? And so I just invited a bunch of girls and we had the best time. That's the way I made a lot of my friends down here in North Carolina. I don't know, you can, I could pick like five things. It's just the whole thing together. It's getting to rap and it's getting to do it with my best friends and it's getting to see Ted every year. And it's such a beautiful sight. I mean, with that gorge going through it and the bridge alone and then all the fog coming up at different times. Um, so it's the whole experience. <laughs>